Hello everybody, Adama KV here, back with another video. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing the Gemini Jets American Airlines 737-800 in the chrome livery. Um, now, the reason why it isn't in its um, package that it shipped in uh, was because yesterday um, I unpackaged it uh, and basically I just forgot to film. Uh, so I asked you guys uh, on Instagram if you guys would like to see a review of the model and you guys overwhelmingly voted yes, 100% uh, actually. So without further ado, here's a review of the model. So starting off with the model, uh, with the box, we have the uh, Gemini Jets box. It is Gemini Jets, of course. Uh, you got the clipboard of the aircraft, uh, Boeing 737-800, American Airlines titles. Look inside. I'll put the model over here. Uh, on the side, it's uh, just normal Gemini Jets. Uh, you got the clipboard 737-800, Gemini Jets. In the back, uh, you have the picture of the uh, clipboard of the aircraft and all the uh, liability information. And of course, this is a... 2019 release. I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah, it is a 2019 release. And of course, here is the flap. That you guys can read. Now, I'm happy that this model didn't come broken to me. Um, I didn't actually uh, order it from any store. Uh, I traded it uh, on Instagram with uh, at aviation underscore dsm so go follow him um for this aircraft uh and another one which i'm not going to do a review uh but anywho now let's move on to the model okay so starting off at the front of the model you have the cockpit the L1 door uh, for landing gear. Red American titles. Uh, now keep in mind this is in the chrome livery. Uh, uh, L1 door. Uh, emergency exits. You got the wings. Then you have the uh, tr uh, red, uh, red, white, and blue stripes, which I really like about the old livery. And I think it just really sort of added the, you know, American flourish to it. Uh, but anywho, I like that you got the wings, the uh, L2 door, the old American um, live, uh, live uh, logo on the tail, and you have the American flag. And of course, down here you have the registration, which I don't know if you guys can see this, is November 921, November, November. Of course, all the landing gear rolls. Uh, the wings are intact, and on the bottom you have the Gemini Jets logo. Uh, but something that I have noticed about this model, I'll zoom out to give you guys a better perspective, is that the wings, and I've seen this problem with a little bit with um, a few Gemini 737s, is the wings are unevenly angled. One wing is lower than the other. Uh, you can see it on the side that one wing is lower than the other and one wing is higher than the other. Um, now, um, I traded it um, on Instagram because I typically was going to get this model. Like I was just going to buy it off of, um, you know, one of the model websites. But after looking at the reviews of the model, you know, finding it broken and seeing Aviation 18's video on the downfall of Gemini Jets, I'll link in the description. I just decided that I wasn't going to get it and I was just going to wait for another Chrome livery. Um, now, I don't actually need this model for EWR. Uh, I just got it because I really wanted it and I found somebody who had it who didn't want it and was willing to trade with me, so I did that. Uh, and this is my first American Chrome livery and I don't plan for it to be my last. Um, and for some reason, there isn't any antennas, but other than that, this model is very, very nice. Uh, would I suggest you get it? No, unless you find somebody who's willing to trade with you a either fixed model or a 
regular uh, model. And that does conclude this video. If you guys like the video, please like, subscribe, turn on the notification bell so you don't miss one of my videos, and comment down below what you think of the model and my video. And that does conclude this video. Once again, thank you for watching today's video, and we'll see you in the next one. As always, goodbye.